What's up, world? All right, so I got on my gear. You know, I got the Batman on the chest. Woke up to probably one of the most surprising things I've seen since becoming a property owner. Oh, right. Well, I'm about to introduce you to the wonders of home ownership. Because when you own the place, you got to do the work. At least until you get your business big enough that you can pay other people to do this stuff. But I refuse to let this issue become a uh, expense out of my pockets when I could easily do this myself. But anyways, check out what we got going on over here. So if you look down, I got the chainsaw on deck. We're getting ready to fill this bad boy up. And then we're about to get to work. But it, it was a fun, fun night last night. I mean, the weather, although it was a storm, it was beautiful. We went and drove up to the beach over in Watch Hill. Just kind of watched the waves come in. One of the benefits of having a truck that's lifted up nice and high. I'm showing them how us Texans do it when we live up in the Northeast. You know what I'm saying? But... Oh, there we go. All right, that's all the oil. But yeah, we did that, had a good little time. Saw the power went out in different parts of Westerly while we were driving, but we didn't think it was gonna happen to our neighborhood. And luck would have it, that is exactly what the hell happened. So, we didn't have any power all night, but that's fine because we had already eaten. And on top of that, uh, it was nighttime and our house actually does pretty dang good with insulation so it really didn't get cold at all throughout the night and thank god the electricity is back on but you won't catch me slipping like that again so i'm going to get a newer generator because the one that i do have it came with the house it's old it needs to be replaced so i was thinking of getting something that can handle gasoline and propane with a little button start but anyway i got the chainsaw on deck you guys are about to see me go through and hack and slash, unleash my inner Jamaican, my Wakandan warrior side, and chop down all these little branches, and then we'll get to the big ones. But yeah, this is another episode of Black Love Talks, and I'm about to show you a labor of love right quick. Let me show you exactly what I mean. Yeah, that's what we're working with today. We are going to be cutting this down. I can turn this around. Show you the damage. I got a boat that I had to cut up, got rid of, threw away. These parts were super hard. I will be taking care of that with another hacksaw. Get that out the way. But yeah, as you can see, my wonderful fence is destroyed. But luckily, I have some extra over here so as you can see we had some high winds and a little bit of lightning as well because you can see some of the charring on the wood isn't that crazy it's absolutely nuts damn and sorry i gotta keep this fence because it's the only way to like block out and have privacy like true privacy, which is amazing. Uh, either way, it is going to get done. I got this part so I, I can add this. And I'm probably just gonna have to get rid of this whole section. But we gonna make it work. Labor of love.
good, y'all. So, we're just about done. Take a look. So, all of the big parts have been taken down. The other side, I'm not gonna mess with because it's not necessarily on my yard, but I will help the gentleman cut it up. But for now, I just needed to get it off the fence so that the rest of it can fall off the tree because that's where it got struck by lightning over there. Yep. So, I'm about to cut this last big piece right here. And then it's prob matter of fact, I think I'm gonna cut over here first. And cut that. That way, when this falls, it should fall that way. And then we should be good to go. Uh, some parts of my fence actually survived the fall. So it won't be too expensive to fix this back to what it was like. I'm just happy no one got hurt. But anyway, you guys ain't gonna see the completion of this today but I will show you the finished result when I start fixing the fence. Anyways, this is Knight Williams signing out. We ain't done. I lied. I got so much firewood up out of this deal. Ain't gonna have to burn no electricity on the heat heating bill this year. That's gonna be nice. I got some good cuts of wood. Oh yeah. Now I'm out for real. Knight Williams signing out.